great grandfather uh, had a, uh, a max uh, car dealership in Aneta, South or North Dakota, and he um, sold this one to my great great grandfather, and then eventually it became my grandfather's. I'm not entirely sure when that happened, but it's been in our family since it was new. And Grandpa has come on this run all 29 years, so this will be his 29th. He had the 1911 for 10 of those, or 10 or 12 of those runs, so, so he's got two. The 1911 is, um, there's a funny story about that, he, because my, my gra great grandfather sold it to somebody else. He ended up buying it back for the cost of a pack of beer. <laughs> so that one's, it hasn't quite been in their family for all, as the same time, not quite as long, but close. Uh, that one's been restored a couple times. But this one, there's a, some fresh paint on the axle and the seat cushion got repaired, replaced, but most of it's all original. And it shows, but I love this one.